American dream. There's a reason they call it a dream. <laughs> Who's there? Cock-a-doodle-doo, pal. No, 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 no! I don't have any more money! My job sucks right now, please! I'll have more money next month! You can't take my house! Is that your signature? Oh, okay, well, just help me work something out, okay? I mean, you said I'm a good credit guy, right? I mean, hey, wait! My dog is in there! No! Don't take my dream! <laughs> Oh, how did this happen? Hardman? Is that you? It's been a long time since the fourth grade. Is that a time machine? There's no need to concern yourself with my stunning accomplishments. Best get in. There's not much time. I gotta go down to the bank and get my life back. They took everything! Oh, bank ain't gonna help you now. Towel in the truck. Extra set of balls, put them on. You're gonna need them. You're gonna get my dream back? No, pal. You are. I'm here to show you how. <laughs> Submitted for your approval. One, First National Bank. What is a bank, you ask? A curious place where both space, time, and irony exist. And yet, don't. Uh, are you going to be doing that the whole time? Pay attention, pile. Exhibit A, those who have come to deposit and safely store their earned monies. Exhibit B, those who need to borrow said money for purposes unknown. Hey, that's me! There go. Exhibit C. The bank only has so much money in the vault to lend out to people such as you. Hey, hey, that's the guy. He took my house. Really screwing my vibe here, pal. Space-time continuum. He can't hear you. Just let me narrate. Now, where was I? <clears throat> so you see, by the time he got to you, pal, his bank was out of money. But he gave me lots of money and charged me a lot of interest. Yes, that's the only way banks make money, by making debt loans. Debt equals money pile. Remember that. Debt equals money. The more loans they make, the more money they make. But if they don't have any money, then where did my money come from? You're gonna want to take a step back, by the way. Whoa! No way! Yes way. And that's nothing. Hey, buddy. Need some money? didn't do that. Oh, they did exactly that, pile. Remember, banks make money by making loans, by selling debt, even to bad credit risks. Yo, have some money, dude. Just sign here. Oh my gosh. Mmm, they called it free money. Yeah, that's exactly what my loan guy told me. Free money. But it ain't free. The worst part was offering money to people who don't even need it. People, pal, like you. You're right. I didn't need him. I was happy here. I didn't need it. Why is he sad? He's making all that money. Shh. He's thinking. Now wait for it. Now wait for it. Bingo. See, the bank is loaned to everyone in town. But to make more money, they have to loan even more. More? How much money do they need? More. Ah, what's that? Behold, a black horse riding. Credit card. Look, I mean, it's gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be okay. What now? Now, with Pi with all this money, we might as well party. Oh, this 
This is awesome. I needed to get my head clear. When I get back, I'm going to straighten all this out. I just hope Dream is doing okay. <laughs> I'm going to get you, my pretty. Yep, he is. I'm sure he is. <laughs> you put it on his tab. Little something for yourself. <laughs> Wait. You know, Wait a second, Harmon. I, I just thought of something. If I got this money from the bank, and the bank got it from the Federal Reserve dump trucks, go on. Then where does the Federal Reserve get their money? Real nice time, ladies. Real nice. Now, excuse me while I borrow it. Say, Hartman, why am I wearing a burglar bikini top? Because no one is allowed inside the Fed. Not you, not me, no American citizen, no duly elected member of our Congress, not the Supreme Court. Not the Supreme Court? Not the Supreme Court, not the Justice Department, not the CIA, DIA, FBI, ATF, ETE, NBC, not even G-O-D. Well, how come the government isn't allowed inside its own building? Government? Ah, the Fed is a private bank owned by private stockholders. Do not let the name Federal fool you. This play is about as Federal as Federal Express. A, a, a private bank? But, but, private? Shh. Best to keep your voice down, Bob. This is Ethan, Federal Reserve. Hey, Ethan, Bill here, First National. Hi there, Bill. How are you? Good, good. We're running a little low on money. No problem. How much you need? Oh, how does 20 million sound? What? Excellent. We'll ship it over first thing tomorrow. Wait, wait, he can just call up the Fed and ask for more money and they give him whatever they want? No, pal. The Fed don't give the banks money. The Fed loans the banks money. The banks have to pay it back with interest. Now, come on, time to go. Wait, 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 wait. I, I still don't understand. Where does the Fed get their money? I mean, if they're a private bank. You said they're a private bank, right? Okay, so who puts money into the Fed Bank? This is Mel, United States Mint. Hi, ML. First National needs another 20 millis. We're already running the presses full steam here, Ethan. Gotta keep making loans, gotta keep the money flowing. All right, you're the Fed. Whatever you guys say, 20 million more by morning. But I don't get it. What's so wrong about the Fed printing money? Because it's unconstitutional, pile. Our treasury is supposed to create our money, but now the Fed controls the printing of America's money. Nobody gets a friggin' dollar that the Fed didn't print. So, they print the money, then they loan it to the government, then they charge the government interest, then the government taxes you to pay for it. Wake up, pal! God, I don't see what the big deal is. Hmm. You know you're right, pal. Wait a minute. Wait, I am? Yeah. I forget how effective they are at keeping you ignorant. Well, that's okay. Hey, I'm not ignorant. Do you even know what money is, Pa? In the law, long ago, people bought it. They traded things they had for things they wanted. I'll trade you my raspberries for that there pot pie. Uh, I don't want your berries. Come on. Wow, those sweet berries. They're not sweet. They're old, and I don't like berries. Give me that pot pie! No! As you can see, this modern situation created some problems. Then one day, a goldsmith walked up and said... Now, everybody thinks gold is valuable, so why doesn't everybody trade gold for things they need? The price was set for gold, and now it was very easy to conduct commerce because people could trade gold for all the things they needed. <laughs> Hartman! Wow! Look at all my gold! Hey! Hey, stop them! That's my gold! Damn, thieves! Say there, pile. I've got a vault and some guards. I can keep your gold safe for you. For a small fee. Yeah, sure, that'd be awesome. You see, pile, this is how the first bank made money. There you go, pile. I owe you 100 gold coins. Okay, great! Come back any time and redeem your gold when you want it. It'll be right here, in my vault. Now you're holding the very first paper money pile. Wow, this is great. It all makes sense. Oh, that's right. It was good, and everybody started using IOUs because everybody knew the IOU was as good as gold. 
Wow, this candy is really a good price. One IOU. <laughs> I'm getting some more for later. Hey, wait a minute. It was just one IOU. Ten IOUs for chocolate? You can't just raise prices like that. Oh, the candy man can. Oh, the candy man can. Wait, that is just freaking wrong. It's called inflation, pal. It makes your IOUs worth less and less until they are worth nothing. Less bang for the buck. Dollar ain't what it used to be. But, but I worked hard and I baked all those pot pies. Now I have to work harder to make less? That's not fair. Oh, if you think that's not fair, you're gonna love the next part. What's he doing? How do banks make money, pal? Uh, by making more loans? Oh, that's right. He's good. See, he prints more IOUs without any more gold, loans him out for interest, makes a pretty penny, and nobody is the wiser. Unless everybody wanted their gold back at the same time. No, 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 no. Th th that's my gold. Not anymore. What are you talking about? I'd like to redeem my IOUs, please. Thank you very much. Hey! Run, bringing people together. See, they all found out he was stealing, made a run on the bank, and demanded their gold. But as you can see, they ain't no gold to get. Hartman, don't worry, pal. Back in these times, vengeance is no be yours. Three things in this world you don't do. Never mess with another man's woman. Never mess with another man's ego. And most importantly, you never mess with another man's money. Else, a man will mess with you. My God, you hung him? Yes, pal. Oh, we hung him. We hung him high. And do you know why? Well, because he was a thief? Because, pal, an evil invention was born. Man discovered how to turn worthless paper into gold. Thus was invented the ultimate machine to steal real money and enslave all the nations on Earth. Oh, now, come on. You're just being dramatic. I, I, I mean, I lost my house, but... What is that? Explain. A nuclear power plant? Mm-hmm. Produces lots of electricity and little pollution. An invention for the good of humanity. Okay, but what's this have to do with... Three, two... Holy atomic energy. A discovery more powerful than anything man had yet conceived. It can be used for good or evil. Now... Unlike Einstein, the goldsmith's discovery has been kept a closely guarded secret. It was never intended for you to see. This discovery is called fractional reserve banking. In the wrong hands, it's more powerful than the nuclear bomb in its ability to completely and utterly destroy a nation who is subjected to its perversion. No, 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 no. It is time we stop this evil secret and the men behind it. You're being ridiculous. Before America is destroyed forever. Believe it, Pat. No, 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 no. I just want my dog back. Damn it. That's it. I give up. Let them live in chains. No, Hartman. The tree of liberty must be refreshed from time to time with the blood of patriots and tyrants. Thomas Jefferson? Mr. President, how do I get him to understand? As we did, son, remain vigilant. Too many have hidden the truth and the light of our liberty dims with every passing day. Quickly, take my horse. Show him. Wait, show me what? Where are we going? Stallion of Liberty! Rahab the Horse! 